Hey everybody, it's Sean from Well Made Things, and first let me apologize to my good friends for not posting any videos in a while. It's, it's you know, sometimes it takes a little while to save up for Well Made Things, as you can imagine, and I'm sure everybody can relate to, and family priorities are always first, so. That being said, I needed a pair of dress shoes for work. Uh, I, we don't have to dress up at work, it's kind of business casual, but every now and then you have to go into the city for a meeting, and you need to look proper and I don't have any pairs of dress shoes at the moment so I wanted to purchase a pair that would last me a while and that would be well made obviously in, in keeping with this channel and uh, I think I've done so today the reason I want to show you this is because I also want to talk about how a company does business and how to do business right because I think this particular company did a beautiful job here and I just want to show it to you. Anyway, I was thinking to myself, you know, if, if I could have one pair of dress shoes, because that's really all I can afford at the moment, what would it be? Realizing that, you know, cost is a factor, but you know, you want to have something that you can resole and that's going to last. And the classic shoe for that is the Alden Long Wing. And I'm going to show you what that is in a minute. Um, but let me first show you how this company does this. This is Leffitt, L-E-F-F. -F OT and they're a company in Manhattan and they sell really nice shoes I think this is the cheapest pair of shoes in their store and it's it's the nicest pair of shoes that I've ever had but you know obviously people go up into thousands of dollars when they buy these handmade custom-made shoes um, that's a little pricey for me and even if I had the money I, I probably wouldn't spend it because there's, there's just other things I'd rather spend my money on but the Alden Longwing does fit into that category and look how this came now I open up this and they've got a lining they've lined the box with tissue paper which I think is really nice it's a nice touch everything's beautifully folded and then we open it up and we see this gorgeous box from Alden of New England custom shoemakers they've been been around a while since 1884 it looks like and let me pull out the box and show you what we've got here Okay, so this is how it came to me. I've literally, I've opened these up. I've, I've handled the shoes. I haven't, haven't worn them yet, but I want to show you how this came from Leffitt. So we open this up, and they've even lined the top here. I don't know if Leffitt did this. This is probably Alden that does this. Nice piece of cardboard there to keep everything nice and stiff as you fold open your purchase there. Handwritten, thank you on the envelope my receipt and other things in here they've got a letter talking about the return policy just so there's no confusion one thing about left it you know they're a smaller shop and I can understand their return policy you can exchange this stuff for a store credit but they don't give any refunds so it's important to know your size before you order but again they're not hiding that it's prominently displayed on their website and obviously it's the first thing you look at when you open the shoe so well done to them I understand that people returning shoes that are torn up or worn um, really impacts the profitability of a fine shoe company I understand that look at these beautiful shoe bags these are Alden shoe bags that come with each Alden purchase really beautifully done you also want to get their shoe trees if you can I didn't get them in this case but I have some shoes wrapped in plastic beautiful and let's get a look at these these are a classic shoe they've been making for many years again it's called the long wing and the reason is it's a wingtip shoe and this is in like a brown calf skin I don't know if you could see in the video here I was gonna film outside because it's such a beautiful day but the wind noise is really loud but I want to show you it's a gorgeous brown calf skin here and that's the Alden shoe so you see it's it's lined on the inside with a beautiful leather really a nice shoe well made you've got these oak bark kind of soles here handmade just really well done the stitching is really nice the welt is really nice I've owned one pair of these before I actually had them their most famous shoe is this shoe in a cordovan they call it a number eight which is like a maroon dark maroon shell cordovan leather which is extremely durable but those are I think they're like $720 something like that don't quote me 
these were $571. So by no means a cheap shoe, but hopefully I'll get some decent use out of them. I just love the way they look. I know they're going to patina just like I like, you know, my Wescos and my Whites boots and those things. I, I love the look of dark brown leather and that lighter sole there, really beautifully done. So hope you like the shoe. Again, I'm going to patronize these guys again because you know what? They sent me a really nice product. They took the time to care about how they presented it to me. So I will go back to a company like this. Thank you, Leffitt. Great job. And uh, I'll let you know how these things go. Maybe I'll do a, a follow-up video a year from now when they're, they're worn in and patinaed a bit. I'm sure they won't be as beautiful as this, but um, hopefully I'll get some nice wear out of them. So thanks for watching. Everybody take care.